What's going on, guys? And welcome to Sons of the Forest, a game I have been waiting for for so long. For so long. And it's finally here. It arrived as of February 24th after many, many delays. And it was going to get delayed again, but they officially announced that it wasn't going to get delayed, but they're going to release it into early access and development was still going to get worked on throughout the year or maybe next year until the full release. So this video is going to be uncut. It's going to be raw gameplay. I'm not going to do any form of editing and you guys can experience the first 30 minutes of the game just, just as it is. So without further ado, remember to like, subscribe and also leave a comment and let's jump into Sons of the Forest. Here we go. Oh, we're in a helicopter this time. So I just want to thank uh, End Night Games for sending me over a copy of this. Uh, and as of recording, this is Thursday, so it's a day before release. Um, and I'm super stoked. So again, thank you so much for the key. I appreciate it. Can we have a look around? Oh, we can look around. Well, we can't really. We're looking out the window right now. We can see the island. Oh, Jesus. I'm already jumping as it is. So there's two helicopters. In the first one, if you remember, there was we was in a, a plane. Um, whoa! So it seems like we are a rescue team. Looking for Edward Puffton, Barbara Puffton, and Virginia Puffton. Interesting. And we can see the map and everything, connection, lost transmission, error site map, and all this good stuff. So we have to go and find these people. We are a rescue squad. We've got Fisheye with us and Kelvin over there. So without further ado, let's close this laptop. And uh, I'm expecting things to get a little spicy. Fight. Demons. Oh. This is giving me Ghost Recon uh, break, breakout break. You know what I mean. Vibes right now. So one thing is, I'm super curious. Depending on where that laptop closes, is that going to be our spawning point? Is that gonna, is it gonna fly around the island multiple times until I finish that cutscene? And is that where it's going to drop us? So let me know in the comments if you're playing this uh, as of this video released and if you landed in the same position. Oh, boy. Did a chair just land in his head? But you know, it's me. I've got to give you the best quality possible. I've got everything cranked up, showing you that beautiful Christmas, Cri not Christmas, Christmas. <laughs> oh, oh, hello. We're in. There's our little backpack open, emergencies only. And we're in. So yeah, guys, let me know if you spawned in the same position. Oh, Kelvin's still here. This looks gorgeous. The river, the sounds, we can already see wildlife. We've got a map in the corner. We can see our hunger, our first, all that kind of stuff. There's more wildlife. We can't see any cannibals, though, but... Here's Kelvin. And I believe, well, I'm certain, uh, this is our companion. We get to give him orders. Uh, we can tell him to go and chop trees or collect rocks. Um, just, just to chill out or even just protect our camp. So I'm interested to see how he works. And from... Uh, so this is how he gets his concussion. 
So that's how he does what you do. He's got a bit of a concussion and all that kind of stuff. So here we go. We can see him to take item, clear five meters, take a break, stay, build a fire, um, build shelter. Uh, we can just get him to follow me right now and we'll just do a bit of exploration. I don't know how much we're going to be able to get in this first 30 minutes. So uh, we're just going <laughs> to... Let's just give him that. There you go. Just follow me, Kelvin. Is that good? So, just like in the first one, you got to scavenge every... Oh, the spiders. Have a look through the containers. See what we can get. We'll have a look at our uh, inventory system in a minute. I think I just picked up C4. I did. I picked up a C4 brick. Duct tape or pills. For some reason, this, this one is sliding away. <laughs> I think some... Wait, was it because there was a spider underneath it? Oh, that would have been... Uh, that's weird. Okay, some sticks. We're definitely going to need some sticks. I want to make a spear straight off the bat, if possible. We've got some flurs. A king oyster. So we've got some food to... I, I, I can tell you now... The performance is pretty decent with the settings I'm running. It's super smooth. It's super nice. The sounds are just... The running water. We've got a deer right here. We've got squirrels. There's a family of squirrels. Birds. I'm expecting just like a, a cannibal just to be staring at me or looking down at me from a tree or something. But let's look in here. We can see our good old trusty pouch. We can turn a light on. Change the color of the light to your own personal preference. Can I put it to white again? There we go. So we've got meals. We've got some pills. Uh, printer resin. We've got inside, the, inside here. We've got a grenade. A backpack. Can put rocks on there in case we need to quickly grab some explosive flurs. Emergency pack. We can pull this in here and open it up. And there we go. Our, our, our tools that we're going to need. So let's throw these down here. What's that? Oh, we've got a lighter. And it's an electric one this time. That's pretty cool. So if I'm not mistaken... Our tactical axe in there, and we can remove it onto our backpack. Very similar to the first one. Let's remove the stick from there, because we're not going to need that on there. We've got our tarp. We've got a stick. And then... Oh, my God. This is massive. And we've already got our tactical jacket on, which we're already wearing. Okay, cool. Let's see if we can find another stick here. Which we did. And then if we jump inside of here, and I was to put two sticks down, a duct tape, and use my knife, it should give us a spear. It diddly did. Diddly did. What's he doing? What's up, Kelvin? So if I go onto this now, yeah, the spear is equipped onto the... Uh, I'm pressing one or two, and it doesn't seem to be working. So, keybinds seem to be broken right now. We can learn the basics of construction, but I think I want to do a bit of exploration. Make sure I've not missed anything here before we move on. Uh, just jab. I'm guessing we can throw this. Yes, we can. Oh, arrows. That's a good thing. I do want to make myself a bone arrow at some point, or even a crossbow. And let's kind of follow this stream down. Um... Oh, let's take some pills real quick. Actually, can I open my backpack from here? I can. You have to hold the inventory key. So I, I've already changed some keybinds, so my keybinds aren't going to be the same as yours. So if I do say, like, tab to open inventory, that's what I've assigned it to. Um, but, oh, we've got our radar here. And we can see we have some something of importance down below us. 
and we can see new enough most of the island. We can see a little bit of snow in the top left. We're on day one, and it's 11.49 a.m. I'm, I would like to maybe head down to a beach. And somewhere that's... Maybe open. So I can see... Oh, you can already see some totems. Oh, what is that? A stun button. Huh. Maybe I'll equip that over the spear. Let's pull our bag in here. Uh, let's remove the spear and add the uh, stun button. And then if I hold tab, since the keybinds don't seem to be working right now, I can whip this out. Oh, it has a battery, doesn't it? Wait, was that Calvin over there? It was. Why is he over there? Did he, Oh, can he not cross or something? I think he ran all the way around the river. You can't be doing that, Kelvin. You're gonna, you're gonna freak me out, buddy. I'm not gonna lie to you. So let's equip this spear then back into the. Let's remove that from the. Put you into there. Okay. All right, Kelvin. Let's go, brother. We got stuff to do. We've got to survive and explore the secrets of Sons of the Forest. Oh, we got something else here as well. Got some more ideas. I am expecting to come across some cannibals and i do believe there are factions in this i have seen the the, the uh five things to know uh, regarding building um the uh and the fact that there's like different factions within the cannibals themselves so we're going to see different things we do have a rod here we're debating to follow this or if I'm going to get ambushed or something. I do want to have a quick look into the build of the... Uh... I'm just terrified just to look somewhere and I'm just going to get getting stirred at, right? Uh, I want to head over to this beach here, but I don't... I'm going to have a quick look at this marker that's beeping. Not Well, not beeping, they're pulsing on the radar here. So for those that are new to the forest or Sons of the Forest, it's an open world survival game. Very much like Icarus, but not time-based. And we can build uh, shelters, we can build campfires, we can build, you know, uh, loads, loads of different things. The only problem is, is you have cannibals. People that are already living on the island, living off the land... And trying to survive themselves, but they don't know who we are, so they think we're a threat. So they're going to kill us. Or try to. But I believe the factions have um, structural or hierarchies uh, with leaders, and they will go off what the leader does, and they'll try to learn from him uh, whilst trying to siege. There's mutants and all that kind of stuff. I don't want to spoil it too much if you've never seen it. But the marker is down here somewhere, apparently. Somewhere around here. One Kelvin. Is this it? Is this a golf cart? This is a golf cart. Look how beautiful this is. Well, I feel sorry when I stream this on Twitch tomorrow. But, like, because it's going to get compressed because of all the foliage. But you guys on YouTube are getting something special here. Because this... Chef's kiss. So I am at a marker, but I don't see... Ah. Oh, God, it's a cave. Yep. We're going to hold off on that. For sure. And I'm going to head down to this beach down here. Let's let's pick up pace here because I want to look into some building materials. Or some bee mats. So if you did play the first one, uh, there was a form of ghost building. I do believe it's still in the game as an optional thing for the you know them old school uh, players. 
but there is a new dynamic building, which I'm super interested in checking out. We are close to the beach down here. We've not seen any form of camp cannibals, or I don't think they're going to show themselves within a certain time limit, maybe. I'm just curious. We're just going to follow this stream down here. Um, is there any fish we can grab? I'm not seeing any form of fish. Can we drink from this? We can. So, Kelvin, you don't need to worry about him. I thought I heard something then. So, with Kelvin, you don't need to worry about feeding him or do not. He does. He does all like himself. And if you do uh, want to see more of this and you're watching this as on uh, Saturday, which is when I'm going to release this. Uh, sorry, Friday, sorry. Um, I will be live streaming this over on Twitch today. So if you want to see more of this gameplay, check the description below. Like I said, this is unraw, unedited gameplay. And if we go ahead and do a series of this on here on YouTube, it will be more edited breakdown. We're going to do builds. We're going to do all that kind of stuff. So... Obviously, let me know if you want to see that. So, in the first one, they had patrols. Like, the cannibals did patrols. I don't know if that's going to be the same in this. Kelvin all the way over there. Oh, there's something out at sea there. You see that? Like a little raft or something. I think I'm just going to set up a small little, like, hut here on the beach and try and figure out how it's going to work. We've got some stick mounds here. All right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get Kelvin. He's going to come to me now. So, Kelvin, I want you to get logs and drop here. Let's see if he goes to a tree now and chops it down. Yeah? Okay, he's going to do that, apparently. Are you? Or are the trees too far away? Or is he just... He won't cut them down. He's just going to grab them. If that's the case, I do want to go and check out the, the physics of the logs myself. And this is going to be a pile of sticks we can just grab, right? Oh, we can't chop this down. Interesting. Got starfish. Okay, let's go and get a couple of trees. And see. He's just stood there right now. I don't know if he's bugged out or what. Oh, he's moving. He's moving. Good old Kelvin. So I saw a little, uh, like, little demo, little, um, oh, God, there's a spider in the tree. Oh, my God, look at that. You don't see that on Minecraft or something, do you? Chopping away at realistic blocks like this, unless you're using a mod pack. So, like I said, if you're playing this as of this has already been released, I hopefully you're uh, you're liking this. And I, I just remembered as well at the beginning, I said I, I, I'm playing this on Thursday, which is the release day, but I actually got it on Wednesday. I'm I'm I've lost my days this week. Is this gonna chop down? Oh oh, timber. And there it is. Oh. Oh. Oh, my. Did 
Did you see that? I was being watched by two different types of cannibals. I was being... Uh, there. Look, he's there. What the hell? Look. Friendly. I don't know if these are going to attack me. I can hear like random splashes right now. Is he going to come and attack me? Hello? Friendly. Can I just crouch towards him? I think I'm getting an audio bug right now. Hi. Friend. Friend. Friendly. No. So there's only two of them right now. But I'm going to be very careful because they might try to ambush me or something. Jesus. Store them down there. If I can, I'm going to try and chop these trees that are here more towards the land down there. It does seem that they have left me alone. And like I said, they, they do have... the There is like a mechanic in the game that gives them some form of brain. So they do remember what you do and all that kind of stuff. So take that into account. And I'm super looking forward to seeing how the de development is, is of this game. And some cannibals will attack other cannibals... He's outside of the tree. He's just looking at me past the tree. Friendly. To be honest, though, he might not like me cutting down these trees here. Well, there's Kelvin. I think he was too far. He must have a radius or something. But he is collecting the logs that I'm grabbing now. And he's gonna, is he going to pick... Help! Jesus, man. Yeah, look, he's picking them up and he's going to take them to the spot. Okay, so... Let's see how the building mechanic works here. So what we want to do is we want to make supports, right? Oh, we can see a red line right there. So... Let's put this down before Kelvin grabs it. And we can chop this into supports, right? So if we go from, like, there... And we can see that I can place this. There we go. That's one. And I want to place another one. Oh, oh, oh. There's a thingy tab. You right there, Kelvin? So it's showing the distance of it. Showing It's showing a grid. That's pretty cool. We can dump that down. Then let's split up these two. I don't know how many supports we're going to need. Kelvin, what's up? Go and do your thing. I'm only going to build something small, just for the sake of this video. And showing you guys a little bit of the building structures and what we can do. Okay, so I can double that up there. Okay, oh yeah, I've cut these in half, haven't I? <clears throat> Kelvin, can I have that? Oh, actually, I want to make more, don't I? Let's make it like a two by two. Uh, two by one, sorry.
And then let's get a log. I think it's going to be one log per each stretch here. Yeah, there we go. So it's doing that. Oh, 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 what the hell? Who's that? Who is that? Yo, that's a mutant. She's coming over here. I don't know if she's going to... Hello? Oh, it's Virginia! Oh, she's... I'm not going to do anything. It's Virginia. She was in the trailer. She can become a companion. We just need to figure out how. Okay, so we've got, like, these logs going down here. And we're making just kind of a little, small little structure right now. And we should be able to complete this. I do need to get some more trees. Like this. And then... So this is the whole new dy dynamic thing. You don't see it as a blueprint like you did in the first one. You can shoot. Oh... Okay, I need to chop some more wood and throw it down here and let Calvin bring some over. I don't know if this video is going to be a bit longer than 30 minutes here, but if it is, you're welcome. I don't know if I'm going to get jumped here or something. I'm going to chop more of these trees. But like I said, if you want to see more of uh, Sons of the Forest on youtube please let me know i will look into doing a series obviously it won't be coming out daily like most videos because it is a time sensitive game and you can see how much content i can do within said time limit for example 30 minutes so it will be very time sensitive unless what you would like me to do is um pull down the twitch vods and put them on the main channel maybe and then cut them up into videos so let me know in the comments of this video what you would like me to do. Because I, I can record whilst I'm live streaming. It's just that I will have chat into... I will be talking to chat at the same time. Which is only going to be the, 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 the other issue, you know. So if you do want me to do that, please let me know. And I'll make it into like one hour videos each or something. And I can release them daily then. Oh, come on. It does seem like I'm going... It is going night time right now. There will be jump scares in this, so... I expect jump scares. Kelvin, come and grab some of these logs, buddy. So Virginia is still over there. I don't have a clue how we can grab her yet. Or how she's going to, uh, how we can tame her. Maybe we've got to, like, give her something. Wait a minute. Hold on. <gasps> we can make ramps. Oh, my God. The building mechanics is so cool. Can I oh, my God. I can. So I can make a ramp up here. There's so much stuff you can do in this game. Like, I either, I've seen in the video as well. Let me try this. So if I was just to put this here, I can actually look at this. I think. Oh, yeah, look. And we can make a spiked wall. It's starting to go dark as well. And the only thing I've got is this little torch. Continue with this flooring.
So I do want to kind of get this house up and running a little bit. But it is going to take some time, like I said. And this, look like, look at the size of this house I've got. Oh my god, it's extremely dark. I don't think I've got any rags as well. Because if I had some rags, I'll be able to make a torch or something. Let's have a quick check. Have I got any rags? No, I don't have any rags. I've got food, though. I've got all that stuff, but... We're more than likely going to get rags and everything from, like, encampments of the cannibals and all that kind of stuff. Oh, but look at this. I'm looking forward to just seeing what the snow biome is going to bring us. The different weathers, how it's going to affect us. Oh, my God. This is extremely dark now. And the torch is only just lighting up about maybe... Two meters, maybe a meter in front of my face. We can see the light on Kelvin, but that's not doing anything. We could just get ambushed here. It's not helping. I've got these extremely bright lights in my face as well, so. Wait, I should be able to carry two logs at once, right? I love how it fills it in like that. So one thing I'm just keeping an eye on is the light on Kelvin. We can start building a walls like this, you know. So if you're into these sorts of games, I would highly recommend picking it up. I definitely need to get torches down and maybe some campfires. There's no way I'm going up to that jungle right there with... Whilst in the dark. My alarm's going off. It's like, Bits, it's time to wake up. Oh yeah, I can cut... Oh. So this is how you make windows! You just chop away at it like that, and then you just, just wait. Can I put another plank on top of the? Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need another one as well, aren't I? I can't see anything right now. Hopefully the visibility's all right for you on YouTube. Wait, we can actually build a uh, a camp, right? Wait, hold on a minute. We can build a little tent. Please bear with me. Let's grab this stick real quick. So we have this canopy up here. So let's equip this. Place that on the ground. And then we're literally just going to get a stick. Place that under there. And then we can sleep. So we're going to save it. New save. And we're just going to sleep. It's a brand new day. Look at that. That's our little tarp we'd have survived under whilst we was building our house. So I do need some food now. And I do want to quickly check if we can fish. Uh, and if let's get some more, any more sticks. Because I do want to kind of get like a... Can I chop this? There was a crunch then, but... Is there any sticks I can quickly grab? If not, I can just quickly go up to the forest here and have a look. I thought I might be able to use like this for like firewood or something. So I would like to get a little bit of a campfire going. I know I have got I've got a MRE kit on me, but I want to just see what the hunting of the food's gonna be like. So we should be able to get some sticks on this. There we go. Let's get a couple more. There we go. Oh, wait a minute. How have they got over there? Hold up. Hold up. Oh, there's cannibals at my at my house. There's two of them. They're a different one. Wait a minute. I remember seeing something in a trailer. 
And I want to see if it, it's actually it's possible. They was over near my hut then. If I was to... Th oh? Throw this in here. Oh, there is water physics. So if I was, like, chopping trees down, I can just throw them into the river and the logs will make it down here. You know? That is pretty cool. Give me a spear. I want to see if there's any fish or anything around here. There has to be fish, right? I see starfish. Unless I need to go out a little bit further. You're right there, Kelvin. What I'm going to quickly do is I've just got a couple of fi uh, fish, a uh, couple of sticks. So if I was to grab a stick from over here, I don't want to combine it. I want to use it. And then I was to say, look at the ground. I can just make a little campfire like that. And then to take it one step further. I can grab a rock and just place them around there to make a reinforced one. Pick up some more of these rocks here. Oh, wait a minute. I do need to grab one of these again. And there we go. We made a reinforced one. So that should protect against the wind. That campfire should last longer and all that kind of stuff. We've got a little bit of a building, a little camp going. So I'm going to leave that there. And if you want to see more, please let me know in the comments. Like I said, it's Unraw. Just the first maybe 30, maybe 40 minutes now. Uh, and please let me know if you want to see more of this in the future. So let me know, like I said. Um, yeah, like, subscribe, and also leave a comment. And without further ado, um, keep smiling. And I'll, uh, I'll see you in another forest video.